Good morning. They're ready to adventure. <laughs> I had some crazy dreams last night. Mm -hmm. Keep having dreams where like you're getting kidnapped and dying and all this crazy shit. I don't know. It's pretty intense. Do you want to leave this out for you? Um, I'll share it with you. No, you won't. I made no, you won't. You can get your own cup. Yeah, cause your butt's no, cause your butt's in the shot, and you can see me in the. Oh, that butt. <laughs> that is my butt. Oh, okay. Excuse me. Hopefully. Oh, you're not wearing any underwear. You're not wearing any underwear. You probably don't want that on camera. <laughs> This is the shot. <laughs> You're just <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh, that looks pretty good. Nice. Already cold. Well guys, we finally made it to the trail, Upper Terminator in Table Mesa, Arizona in my 1987 Defender 90. For reference, I'll be running 37 inch maxi treppies and I'm locked front and rear. <laughs> my doggos, I love them. First obstacle, when I pulled up, there's a rolled over YJ, so I said, uh, I think I'm gonna take the chicken route. The dogs too. This trail is probably about one to one and a half miles long. Uh, same as Lower Terminator. They're relatively short trails. Uh, it could probably take you about an hour to two hours each, taking the time, crawling around. Definitely bring some tools and some spares if you got them. We just reached the second major obstacle over here and I think the dogs had just about as much fun running through this water and catching tadpoles as I had driving through it. I uh, feel pretty privileged to say the least to drive through such an epic canyon with my truck. It's pretty badass. <laughs> Tongue out. Ooh. Definitely a face only my mother can love. Sorry, Mom.
That was a good one. Are you recording right now? Yeah. What'd you think of that one? We got really lucky. We didn't see a single rattlesnake all day and that's really atypical of Arizona this time of year. So far, I've seen probably 10 to 12 rattlesnakes uh, in the last couple weeks alone. They, they're really out there and we have two dogs so we really have to be wary. They are a snake train, FYI, but still. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoy this little lunch video as much as I did making it. Yeah, Miguel really loves that chair. Um, I keep trying to convince him to get a new one, but he just doesn't want one. He just loves that stupid old chair. Uh, yeah, no, I love this chair. Um, it's my favorite chair. I've had it forever. And it, it's the best, and I don't care what anybody says. Maggie was actually nice enough to buy me a new chair after the little mishap that I had. Thanks, Maggie. So our typical trips include packing lots of snacks, driving out to nice spots, preferably really hard to get to spots, and basically whip out the chairs, sip on some beers, and just watch the dogs play and hunt. That's like one of my favorite things to do. It makes me so happy just watching these dogs have a good time. And that's why I love wheeling too, because the dogs get to have fun. They get to run around. There's not traffic. There's not people hammering down. It's just slow rock crawling in the canyons and the dogs have such a good time. And if you know anything about German short hair pointers, you know they have a lot of energy and they need to release that energy. So wheeling is a perfect way for them to do that. They're just hunting tadpoles and rabbits all day long. Uh, successfully, I might add. Just gotta watch out for those choyas, jumping choyas. They are nasty and we definitely don't go anywhere with choyas around because, oh man, they'll literally blind your dog. Stay away from the choyas, my friends. If anybody here is wondering, Remington, uh, he's six years old and he is a stud available for services. Hit me up. He'll definitely appreciate it. He's had two successful, beautiful litters so far. And no, him and Oakley are not related. You guys probably don't give a shit. <laughs> but I do. I do. I love him to death. Also, if you guys are wondering, yes, Megan is walking behind the Land Rover for the duration of this trail. Uh, thanks, Maggie. Shout out to you. Love you. And I love that you put up with my shit.
This is my favorite part of the trail, right here. Such a good time. You just almost flipped your truck. <laughs> you see that wheel lift? Check out this next section. Oh man, that had to have been my favorite part of the day. For sure, that was that was a little bit stressful, but man, that's that's why I get out here. Oh, it was so fun. And I'm already trying to get back. I gotta drop my tranny though. Got a noise coming out my clutch. I think it's either a pilot bearing or a release bearing. But Got to take them apart to find out, and I'll be doing that the next week. Let's get this last little bit. Maybe I'll make a video about it, post it, see what you guys think. Upper Terminator Trail. Uh, it was a really, really good trail. I got a little bit of wheel lift, had a great time. And now we're relaxing by the river. The dogs are tired. And it's time to chill. Drinking beer, eating snacks. Cheers. Well guys, that's it. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Not sure about the voiceover aspect of it, but I guess we'll see what you guys think. Um, make sure to subscribe, I guess. I don't really know how it works, but I'm definitely gonna be making lots of videos in the future, so cheers, later.